was a dream that was real. It shall be realized. These are the wishes of Marcus Aurelius. Okay, it's about time to conquer the rest of the world. Hold on, tell me Mountain Plain had another patch. We'll see. Looks like it, it looks like it did, to be honest. Each hotfix and each patch screws up the textures for, from the mods. The game like needs to reload them again. I'm gonna go look it up. What exactly did they change? Now the last update was February 3rd. Hmm, weird. Right, I only picked up the guys that I can actually, you know, get in the army. With zero money. We're at war, I think, with the Western, yeah, with the Western Empire, and they don't actually have anything. Which guy this sucks because we can't actually kill him. This doesn't, yeah, it's not red actually, like a darker red. Maybe you'd say it's Blood Raven red. Okay, we picked up all that. Oh, I don't want to declare war on the Batanii, so we, you know, finish them off. Take all their, all of their territory. And we were chasing an army or something here, if I remember. I mean, quote unquote chasing. There is literally no way we can catch him. Oh no, 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 never mind. We just had a battle with him. Yeah, yeah, that's what happened. See, look at their speed. There is no way we can catch any of them. Even if we, like, let go one of the guys in my party, they can't even catch him. Fortunately. They get plus five lo loyalty bonus. Ooh, that's actually pretty good. Yeah, this, this that's awesome. But uh, I'm not gonna sit anywhere. Need to be on the move. Okay, now, a good thing would be to actually get them all into the settlement and besiege it. Easiest way to kill them off. To be honest. Okay, the Gladius. Okay, that's set. I just hope they attack us. Honestly. This is a way to avoid like uh, the the sieges being uh, bugged out still. Just destroy, just destroy the walls, right? Easy. Just takes a little bit. Go 
Wait, what? Who? Oh, rebel army, never mind. Rebel faction, that is. What do we can do about that? A lot of the cities we have will actually revolt. Nothing I can do about it. Come on, crack it. Ain't that hard. Oh, I so wish they had actually attacked us out here. taken a lot longer probably because this is like a level 3 settlement and if I had to assume does it actually say anywhere not really let's lay the troops anyway It's taking a while to load in, to be honest. Not exactly sure why. crash or something no it's still going okay, there we go yes per usual we're gonna skirmish Actually, like, skirmishing with these guys might be, like, a little bit more difficult, right? Since in theory, theory they should, uh, why is the sound like this? I'm not sure if we can hear that. Maybe this red is a little bit better as well. Looks nicer. Archers! Infantry fight! Infantry! Move! Let's move our guys a little bit closer.
Jewel. Rising lack of kills here. Okay, there we go. Apparently they have no archers. Which is um, surprising, considering their cities and all that. Really? Like, where the hell are the archers? Oh, there they are. Run, 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 run. Actually, this might be a better idea for them to just, like, shoot my infantry in this side. Smart AI, look at that. the new MMO that released, well, right? Uh, the Ark or whatever it's called. That seems pretty good. Or you know, just play, play Hearts of Iron, but like with mods. That usually works. Especially now since they added uh, the tank, tank designers as well. Seems to be an issue here. Oh. Well, that Red Dead Redemption, if you haven't played through the game, is definitely a good game. One of the best. And especially if you like, go like all in and like finish all the side quests and hunt all the special unique animals and all that. You can spend over a hundred hours in the game. Easy. The Ghost Freak and the Ubisoft games are just um, um well Ubisoft games. You suck ass either way. Oh look at him. Traitor. Maybe they pillaging and pillaging pillaging the cities is not the best of ideas, right? Since they revolt so much. I uh, will have a. Um, I will start a, like a, a berserker only playthrough soon enough. I think we, I'm gonna like conquer the map. This 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 you know this stream. I'm gonna probably go like, uh, there's a mod called uh, Sturgia is Norse. I'm gonna probably play that one because the other one, Wrath of the Norm Northman, isn't updated. Or was like the last update was for, for version 1.5.6 or something like that. So I'm probably gonna play that one. Uh, Sturgia is Norse. Unless the other one gets updated with a uh, like realistic battles mod. A bunch of other ones that make the game a little bit better apparently so that should be maybe tomorrow actually i'm not sure i mean i don't need to conquer everything here you know because there is no position more or less it's gonna be piss easy to take all this to be honest yeah i'm surprised we didn't like face more rushes in that battle but i guess we 
brought their walls down, so there's no point in having archers on the walls. If you're the AI, if you're a player, you would drop your archers on the wall so they shoot that the guys is coming through the breach, right? Because that's what you do. Or what you're supposed to do. So yeah, my, a new, like I, did, I mean, I don't need to capture all of this, especially as I think the biggest problem is going to be the revolting settlements all over the place. Like this one revolted and the Batania I took it. I don't plan on fighting the Azerai because they're not modded. Then again, I did almost knock out Sturgia. Or I'm going to call, the, call them the Norse. Even though they're not modded. I mean, uh, we could take on the Dacians, but they didn't. <laughs> they, no, they had no resistance. There was no resistance in taking this. Oh, look at this. This one has four villages. Ooh, that's a nice one. Rich, probably. I'm gonna take the coast. Well, not the coast, but like this area here. And move through the desert. And... There's a good way to take these guys on, really. Because there's a million passes through the mountains as well. You know, level ups, never mind. I do want to, like, get the big battle with the city so we can just see how, how much we're going to struggle with them. But, um, they kind of run away. I can't catch him. Okay, they're traveling. Where are the where are the rest of our armies? Okay, this guy is going all the way over there. I don't think he's gonna make it though. This guy is just going to a point. It's as per usual for the AI. You just go to a point. Watch this. As soon as they get there and besiege that, they're like gonna have an army. Oh, oh. Please, 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 please. Which one was it? Yeah, go catch him. Catch him. Yes. Yes. Come on. Come on. I'm here. Grab him. No, not you. Get them. Come on. Yes. Finally. And I'm actually thinking of playing Prophecy of Pandora again. Of Warband, that is. But, but like, I, have, I don't have an idea for like a, a theme I would go for in Prophecy of Pandora. We did the Roman one. We did start a, like a whole new faction. Or our own faction. And I think I was, I went with the Fields Wayne at some point. So I'm not sure what the what the gimmick would be for the next one. Okay, now is there all skirmishers? I think. This, yeah. See, what? Why do they like face that way? This makes no sense. Okay, how about the square formation? Now I would need to like. Okay, there we go. Never mind. Um. They they don't want to have archers in in, in the inside of them, apparently. I guess circle formation is gonna be. Or we can uh, the, right hugging the wall ain't gonna help. <clears throat> what? Okay, being on on a hill is gonna help definitely. Which one though? Maybe here.
250 gigabyte SSD. Oh man. I mean, I got the one terabyte M M.2 and uh, I don't have, I can't install that many games on it to be honest. Is gonna be getting these guys in here. Okay, there we go. Riders! A new Skane. Follow, follow me. Hundred and twenty six Scrimshaw Archers. A lot of needs an SSD. I don't know. I'm just used I'm used to like fast loading times at this point. I am thinking of like grabbing um maybe ten terabyte or twelve terabyte hard drive to just install all the games they have on it. What's up, Sammy? You missed a lot, man. We all we, we conquered the empire. I mean, conquered the, I think two thirds of the world at this point. I grab a hundred twelve terabyte hard drive and just install all the games on it, then just move them to an uh, SSD or M.2 when you want to play them. Honestly. Oh my god. Okay, actually, let's. Yeah, they're not gonna do anything smart. SME, I could actually... What do you think about this idea? I could just go and play j j the Giatics, right? The Dacians. Or the Batanii, because they're modded in this. They're kinda Norse. Face the wrath of the empire. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, it's gonna take a while to kill all these. I'm surprised they don't have more of them. Then again, that's probably because we outnumber them two to one. It seems the circle formation is working at least. Why do they get standard bearers? Alright, oh, we have the uh, what eagle standard bearing ones. Actually surprised I'm still alive considering this is on, on, on the highest difficulty. I didn't get shot in the head or something. They call me the tree dodge. Oh sh there I go. And does it does it work fine? Or is everything, you know, fleshed out and it's, it's how it's supposed to be? Because the question would be. Oh my Jesus Christ. Oh, that may be a problem. I just now realized if I go down, the AI is gonna do some stupid fucking shit. Works perfectly. Good. That does it. Hmm. I'm gonna use the ba uh, battle realism mod. You know. Improved garrison, of course. I'm gonna keep on distinguished service. I, th I think that they actually updated distinguished service as well. Kind of changes uh, uh, the amount of skill they're gonna get, or the or the like skills you pick for them, depending on how much kills you they get. I might actually turn on fill stacks as well and like play on the hardest difficulty straight away with a two hand and axe and a three 
bundles of throwing axes or something like that. As Ragnar as king, <laughs> of course. Why wouldn't it? Why not have Harald Hadrada in it? That would be a little bit better. And more fitting to timeline. Uh, well, what is what, what actually is the timeline in uh, Ben Lord? Like what era is it based on? Yes, we're gonna slowly move in a shield wall towards the enemy. And get shot in the ass as well. What are the archers facing though? I guess they're facing their skirmishers. Kind of. And the infantry is going for their infantry. Okay, this is gonna take a little little while since they have I think six six hundred troops or something like that. Then again once we get up in their spawn it should be should be a massacre. This red definitely looks better than the other one though. The bright one. Come on, come on, eat them. Eat them up. Oh, don't turn them back. Don't turn your backs towards them. What? The, the fuck is the... Oh my... Okay, I'm not gonna look at this. Fuck it. I'm gonna alter resolve the battle. I don't wanna lose a million troops because of the AI stupidity. Look at that, six troops lost. Oh yeah, the Valkyries are the elites. Or the nobles, right? Indigo, that's 50 damn. I actually don't know if this is good or bad. Like, I don't know the damage numbers for bows at all. Wait, we can use this one, but not the other one. Last bow speed. Okay. Wait a minute. What, their bows don't have requirements? Well, that's fucking stupid. Like go on uh, in Sergio's nose, probably go on like melee only, foot only, which is gonna be real interesting. I'm probably not gonna get very far in the mod though, a lot, like not in a timely fashion at least. We just go. Let's pick a couple, a couple more guys up. If I go on foot only. It should be interesting to see how uh, how good, how fast am I gonna be when I have a shit ton of athletics and the like. Mm, you kind of want to have light armor on, and then kind of so you can move faster. Beowulf, of course. I'm actually not sure what I'm gonna call the character. If in your party have their melee weapon skill. That doesn't matter. Party leader actually does. Okay, so the first one. Alright. Let me show you the mop. The mop. The mop. Yeah, the mop. I'm gonna show you the mop. Let's see, Sturgeons have three cities left. 
two castles and three cities. The Batania are gone. They just have one cat, one city over here. The Western and the Southern Empire are gone. Are gone. We're just at war with them still. Funny how I got war exhaustion and they don't. Let me actually look at the stats. Let's set this to offensive. Fuck it. Apparently they inflicted more casualties, too. Well, that makes sense. And the, uh, these factions did like fuck all, basically. Then we became the faction leader once the, the, you know, the previous one died. Another problem, uh, did you actually like get an alliance with anyone? With this uh, diplomacy mod? Because, like... Uh, Everybody hates us, so no one wants. Uh... Yeah, no one wants uh... an alliance. I guess if you start your own faction, it's gonna be a little bit easier or something. And I have no clue why the Western Empire has so many clans in it still. Well, the Southern one only has uh, three. I think these are mercenaries, right? Execution guy. <laughs> uh, and I kind of wish I executed everyone from the Southern and the Western Empire really at this point. Because there is no way to get rid of them. Like, look, look at that. They have no territory. But they inflicted more casualties. And supposedly if I propose a peace, they're go I'm going to be paying them as well. Which is... Um, Annoying. Oh my god, what the hell is this? Alright, maybe I should have uh, not executed some of the lords so we can actually get a... Maybe get a... Decent relations with an enemy, like king or something. Let's see. Let's actually see. Maybe I can force that somehow. One of them to like me. Actually, this one does like. He has the minus nine. Everyone else has more than that. Actually, if anyone wishes, schmooze the Azerai. I don't want to go to war with them. Let's see if you get some options to like persuade them or something. Tell him he has pretty eyes and all that. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Yeah, I'm gonna take this piece them up. Look, they, they literally have no garrison in here. Piece them out and take care of the Sturgeons. Norsemen. Could you knock out at least one of them? Jesus Christ. Those guys are just traveling. Yeah, good good use of you. Why don't you go besiege something? Right, I need to take out the surgeons since they have the least left. Well, except the Batanians, they only have one city left. Biscuit the loyal. Funny how he's the only guy who actually has the. Wait, is it? Yes. Yeah, is it? Let's actually check plans. Uh, where's Biscuit? Yeah, he has the same banner as me, dude. Oh my 
god, this takes a while. And this is how we get rid of the fixed sieges. You just break down the walls, right? Easy. I have no clue who got wrecked there, to be honest. They besieged something already, god damn it. Oh, who now? Oh, this is nice. I do love it how everything goes to shit in a matter of seconds. Okay, you fuck off because you have nothing. Nothing to take, nothing really, well, not really I can do against them except like capture and execute them all. But that would take too long. did drop in on one of my siege battles where I did the exact same. I just... Oh, like imagine defending this. Like plop down the shield wall right, right there. In that like little crevice. I have a shit ton of arches on the walls there. You know what? I might actually just... Uh, you know, have... I might just go like play uh, custom battles, you know? Oh my god, why do we have so many archer things? Like at one point just uh, do custom battles and the custom defensive siege battles. Because we can't get the defensive siege no way, no how. Hey, I just wanna... does just doesn't wanna do it. What's the mod called that allows you to actually get custom battles with the modded troops? Because, uh, you know, you go custom battles, the game crashes instantly. You have a mod on, I think. Well, a mod that changes troops around, that is. Come on. God. Stanford Bridge. Uh, yeah, that's that's one where uh, Harold Hadrada fell, right? Wait, no. Uh, is it? I'm not sure anymore. It's been a long time. It's a read up on history. In the Middle Ages, that is. They don't have that much defending this. Like, if you if I could get a, like a defensive siege here, that would be so awesome. Like, you know, plop down and shield wall here, and place your archers up on the walls to shoot down on the enemy. Oh, that would be so nice. Yeah, Berserker killed forty guys on the bridge, and then. They didn't, couldn't kill him, so they like had a, a couple of guys go into a boat and stab him from the bottom through the bridge. Well, it's all sagas anyway, you know. If it's true or not, nobody knows. No, yeah, look at that. We have traitors here. The Civil Legionnaires. Well, actually, no. The Civil Legionnaires will be in the Azerai territory, I guess. Kind of. Parthians and all that. Why are you defending the gates? 
No one told you we're not going through there. Yeah, they, they are definitely, but it's so freaking hard to get the AI actually to attack you unless it's like literally hopeless. Like 200 versus a 2000 or something like that, you know? And I almost got the defensive siege battle going, but um, they of course decided to walk off like at a random point. I don't know why. I think I had like 400 troops in the city. Versus there's uh, or 300, well, 400 with 100 garrison or something like that. And they had like uh, 1200 or something like that. It's so hard to get them to actually attack you. Well, um, then, then again, why would they attack you if you have a garrisons like uh, let me, give me a second so I can show you you know garrisons from like 200 troops 300 troops five 450 troops Jesus Christ almost yeah almost 500 troops the garrisons higher tiered ones like as well okay made it so they like have 50 archers Wait, how the hell did they get that much? 130 or 140 archers and uh, 100, no, 160 infantry. Plus everything else that people dump in them. So like, <laughs> yeah, nobody wants to besiege that. Okay, show mercy because we don't want this to revolt, to be honest. Had enough of revolts as of now. Plus, we can hold 500 troops, which is too much. I wonder how much how much can you actually like have if you just recruit the uh, the optios, centurions, and pill spriers. I like what's the max they can give you. Or is there a max, better said? Hmm. Maybe I should ch start chopping heads, right? Could be a good idea. Let's see. You can pick up a spear or a weapon from the ground while mount... Oh, interesting. Long reach. Wait a minute. So how much throwing, throwing weapons can you have in the end? Like, what was the, what's the default one? Okay, so stack amount four. And we have 14 in battle, so we're gonna have, uh, we'll see how much I get. And do the math. There's too many up upgrades for that. Okay, now. Peace out, everyone. Doesn't mean I'm long enough to consider peace. The, fa the fact that all these guys in the in the faction are war mongers don't doesn't actually help that much. Okay, nothing I can do against the Ezer. This is what I was like scared of. Well, not scared of, but like it's gonna be annoying. Ooh, look at that biscuit! I think biscuit is our best marshal. I'd say. Here they're gonna. Okay, this guy. This guy is defending what? 
Hey, you. You fucking moron. How about you go knock out the army over there? Jesus. Two K troops on the field. <laughs> Wait a minute. Which which CPU do you have and you can handle that? Really? Like uh I mean I dropped below sixty on a thousand versus a thousand. Like all the all the setting uh, graphic settings that affect CPUs are like turned down all the way. And I wanted to be good with you. I wanted to schmooze you up and you declare war on me, you bastard. All right, I did the quest with the dragon banner and all that, and um, it doesn't work if you already are in a kingdom, apparently. I guess we can't really schmooze him. Okay, let's go knock out the Northmen. Pretty easy enough, doesn't they don't have that much troops, that many troops. Like what kind of CPU do you have to like run this game at like since I have 144 Hertz monitor, 144 Hertz or 144 FPS that is. Because I did do, did do the benchmarks and the GPU can handle it, no issues. The CPU can't though. Get two, two cities, two castles. What about you? Okay, let's give a, give another city to him. Wait a minute. Can I actually force a piece? I can. Nice. I nine. Yeah, that's gonna gonna do it. Intel processors always had the better IPC. Well, AMD overtook him a little bit, I guess, in the newest ones. But I'm probably gonna buy a Intel setup at some point and use that for, you know, gaming. Here's the Ryzen for all the other stuff. Actually, might be a just better idea to sell the Ryzen system and get an Intel one. The new one that is L nine hundred K. Although I don't, I'm not sure if uh, actually didn't see any DDR five being sold anywhere. So that might be an issue. In my area, does. Where's the fourth one? Come on. Yeah, our guys took another settlement. They're actually doing something. Wait a minute, what was that? Don't tell me something of mine, mine is being besieged. Nice of the old Republic, right? Yeah, the Star Wars one. What kind of... Like... Usually it's the guy who's the gamer, but apparently in your situation, your girlfriend is the gamer, and she took the PC from you to play the game. <laughs> but then again, that forced you into getting a high-end PC with a high-end GPU as well. Do you have a ton? Okay, let's give it to him. 
I still have like a uh, corruption because I have too many fives, thieves. I guess that doesn't actually matter. It's like a in total war, I guess. The further away the thing is from your no capital, the more corruption, the more money you lose. You met in Kotor. Were, were you a Sith and she was a well, a Jedi, I guess. Or a bounty hunter, yeah. And she was Princess Leia. Oh, I so wish you could actually zoom out to see what's happening on the map. Okay, walls are down. I could just auto resolve this, to be honest. All of these. Uh, but, um, you know, that would be too easy and too quick. I might do it uh, if I want to finish this campaign or run today, which we may do. So we start a new one tomorrow. Or the day after. Oh my god. They, uh, there's no way I'm gonna actually get the archers in a good position here. From all the rocks. Yeah, I do remember you're from Belgium. Blah blah blah. Punk. Speak. So, so you move in together or what? I hope so. A relationship over the... Well, you couldn't say the wire. I guess you could say the wire. Still. Or a distance. Not that um, great. Oh my god, how the hell am I gonna get the... Oh, what the hell are these rocks? Or are these actually grave... This is a graveyard, isn't it? It's a tomb! Not a mine, it's a tomb! I do kind of like these uh, cities a bit more and the castles. Look at that. So tell me this. The Belgians have the best chocolate or is, this, or is it the Swiss? That's the ultimate debate. Look at that, 18 pilum. So 9 per stack. And I can have 3 stacks on me. Okay, maybe don't get killed yet. Well, that's nice. Like, people, you know, finding uh, their loved ones on the internet is always nice to hear, and it actually works out even better. Chocolate and fries. Fries? Really? Um, well, then I'm gonna uh, never thought of as. Fries is a, like a. You know, they're fries. I mean, it's fucking potatoes. It's not much to it. Just fry them. Did they patch the game silently and the archers are actually standing behind the walls? Did they actually make the AI a little bit smarter? Yep. Or I just got dumber. Uh, one of those two. Now, well, this actually looks like a castle, right? Like uh, a couple of houses to prepare food, like a meat hall and... I can 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 say it. Uh, that's too small to be a meat hole. Maybe the meat hole's in there. Guys can sleep over. The guys can sleep over here. <laughs> the Belgian discarded. 
Uh, all oh, right, French fries, right. Sorry, I, I, I forgot about the French fries. Forgot about the French part of it. I don't know, honestly, I don't like French fries that much. I'd rather have like slices of, you know, potatoes. It's sli not slices, but you know what I mean, like cut up in like you cut up a potato into four pieces and that's it. Then again, we don't have a McDonald's here, which is um, amazing. Morale. Uh, I think, yeah, let's eat it. And I think I just claimed this for myself, did I? Yeah, I did. What's it called? I'm not gonna try to pronounce that. A gift. Who has the least amount? Let's give it to the Scipios. They're the ones who brought us glory after... Ah, shit, maybe I shouldn't. And I'm from Bosnia. No, it's the same deal, more or less. Well, except the fact we don't have a McDonald's in here. Kind of failed in my city. Because, uh, well, people like our, you know, our own version of burgers a bit, a little bit more than one, what McDonald's offers. Besieging motherfuckers. What the fuck were you doing, you piece of shit? Why didn't you attack him? Oh, someone please make a mod where you can actually, like... Tell, tell the army, like, go there, do the thing. Not just have them wandering around and fuck all, as per usual. That, that one guy is gonna be see. Right, ah, uh, shit. I need to play. No, 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 no. Yeah, apparently you can't take it decently. I'm gonna auto resolve this normally. I'm normally as per usual, right? I do need to place. Okay, then they got militia. Yeah, I'm gonna go in there, like dump a couple of troops in there just in case. Because that's gonna be get besieged instantly, for sure. In battle mode, if you don't do none well, true. Wait a minute. All oh, right, I paid for the upgrade. Well, I mean, uh, they took some of it. I mean, they took this castle. Like, I had a problem last stream here somewhere. Where was it? Yeah, this, this, like, this area here. Like, we took this. It got, re it rebelled. We took it again. We lost it. And this guy, like, this area, they were just fighting over this area. With the, the Triatic Empire. Or the Dacians forever. They can do fuck all while I was like doing the thing and you know taking all of this by myself, of course. Okay, you, you go there, go there, come on, 